once you've had some liquid, you want to start with an intro and then I will cut in and at a good point and just be like, yeah, but it's Nuzlocke. Okay. What do I need to say in the intro? Just, you know, Highway 47 and we're trying a Nuzlocke again and then, or we're playing Pokemon again or whatever. Okay. Just, just figure it out. <laughs> Cool. Times were tough, so I sold my soul. And I don't think I'll ever regain control. Devil look me in the eye, and I'll look the other way. What else could I do? I just stood at the doorway and you. I'd rather be drunk with you. I'd rather be drunk Hey, Internet! Highway 47 here, and I'm Draco Phone. Also here is Vomit. Hey. So we're here today, and we're doing the Noozle Pokemon... The poo- the Noozle? The, the Pokemon, um... Nuz... Nuz... Nuzball. Nuzball. Um... Nuzball. <laughs> what, what do you know already... about Nuzlocke runs, Draco Phone? Um, the, the, the Nelson run. The Nelson run. Pokemon Fire Red Nelson run. So is this the thing where you randomize the stuff and... Randomize is just a side thing for us. Oh, randomize is just a side thing. Yeah, the the Nuzlocke rules are not, like, strictly enforced, but there is a loose set of rules and you just pick whichever ones you choose for your gameplay okay so you're doing the stuck with what you got and death is yeah, final like, like death is final is like the key rule uh okay. but the rules that we've set out number one you can only encounter you can only catch the first wild encountered pokemon in each area a number okay. two for a starter is chosen by the last digit of the trainer id one through three is the first ball four through six is the second seven through nine is the third if it's a zero, we actually get to choose. Each number three, each Pokemon we catch must be given a nickname. So you know, then we get mentally attached to them and cry when they die. Number four is a simple one. The battle style is set to set. Number five, any Pokemon that faints is considered dead and must be released. And number six, blackouts slash whiteouts are considered game over. Okay. And yeah, as you said, not knowing which was actually part of the rules and which was just added bullshit that we added, uh, this is a fully randomized ROM. So, starters are random, the movesets are random, the types are random, where items are located, everything's random. Right. Right. So, you're going to do the normal. Yeah. This is... Oh, excuse me. This is probably as close as the Pokemon version of your reusable space program as we have. Uh, Are things exploding? It, uh, yeah, we already lost a one megabyte circuit. How? What? I'm not. So you can't really run a randomizer on a uh, legit cartridge, so it's not a legit cartridge, and it's saying that. You see, you've seen an intro to a Pokemon game, so I'm just gonna skip past this fast. The welcome to the world of Pokemon my name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as Pokemon Professor. This is the world inhabited by far arrived a creature called Pokemon. And for some reason, Pokemon put other to battling myself. I study them as a profession. Get back in the ball, you piece of crap. But for the first time, a little bit. Okay. Do you have a coin near you? Uh, possibly. Like, what? Does it matter what type of coin? And it just needs to have a heads or tails. Okay, I found one. Okay. Uh, heads is boy, tails is girl. Go ahead and flip it. Heads. Heads? We got a boy. Oh. What would you say this guy's name is? Well, I guess it's us. What do you say our name is? Uh... Um, I didn't really get a good look at him, but I feel like he's a, um, um, Fleek. Fleek? 
Fleek. All right. Fleekin. Fleekin. Ian. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So your name is Fleekin, huh? Sure. All right. So what about this jerk? You got a name for him? Ray. Ray? With an mm. E or an A? With an A. But put an E at the end. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's so white. <laughs> yeah. I I already don't like him. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, you start out here in front of an NES. As Shaggy was pointing out, you start your game in front of a game and you can walk over to your computer and play a game. First, we need to set this up. Tech speed to mid. Battle system to set. Okay. Come over here and get our free potion. Da -da. Okay. I have a confession. You've never played Pokemon? I've never played Pokemon. That's not as uncommon as you'd think. I know the generation get one games really, really well. Which is why I randomized, because I don't think I would enjoy doing a Nuzlocke run of... I guess this is a remake of the first one, so there's some things that are different about it, but... Yeah. So what console did this originally come out? This version is for the Game Boy Advance. Which is why it's all, like, colored. I never had a Game Boy. Aww. You wanna borrow one? <laughs> Can loan you Pokemon Blue. I think my wife had one. Yeah, I played Draco Funkies. Oh. Uh, Fleekin. Our trainer ID ends in a zero. That's where we actually get a pick. Cool. Cool. So we have a Togepi. The, uh, the rock type. A Loudred. Oh, I think I know which one you're going to want. Grass type. <laughs> and Vulpix. The electric type. What do you think, yeah, that, Draco Funk? It's a hard choice. Because initially, like, I kind of wanted to go for the Loudred, but I like Vulpix, too. Yeah? Uh, you, want, you want to flip that coin for it? Say this one is heads and this one is tails? Okay. Heads. Heads. It's the Loudred. What, what would you... Yeah. All right, we got to give him a nickname. It's for the rules. Banshee. Banshee? Yeah. All right. You were you were sitting there thinking of that one. Yeah. Uh, what is it? Banshee. Banshee. I was gonna do it with an S, but you know, leave the C. It's perfect. Oh, I thought you're gonna be like Banshees. Sure. <laughs> no, I am not doing Banshees. I do not want to think about banning cheese. See, if we'd pick the Vulpix, then we have to be fighting Banshee the entire time. That would be bad. Yeah. So we know Togepi's a rock type. Uh, why did I look here? I don't want to look at us. I want to look at the Pokemon. <laughs> uh, grass Rock. I've, you know, that's like it's like a mix between blue grass and rock. Yeah. Grass Whistle, which is normal. Odor Sleuth, which is rock. Mud Shot, which is grass. Ooh, that's... That might be the move right there. And Twin Needle, which is grass. I, You know, Odor Sleuth and Mud Shot, like... Those... those. <sighs> Never mind. Nah, Odor, Odor Sleuth isn't that great. 
And that one puts him to sleep, so we're going to need that for catching. Alright. Mudshot's going to be the move. Calling it now. That's going to get us through this fight, unless it doesn't. Bend over, I'm going to give you a mudshot. Um... Mm. All right, Elite Trainer Ray. My God, I want to punch him. <laughs> Screw the Pokemon battle. Just let me slap him. Oh, yeah, it's got to tell us how to play, which, you know, Dragofunk's an expert, so we got this. Yeah. Yeah. One shot. And it's dead. <laughs> Perfect. Mud shot. I told you. Yeah. It's super effective. Yeah. Way to be an elite trainer, Ray. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Here's the win. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. No. The catch rules don't apply yet because we have to do the uh, pre-game fetch quest. I have, I usually like to pre-game if I can. It. This would be the game for it. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 so yeah, there's a chance we'll get a zigzagoon. A zigzagoon. Zigzagoon. Let's try mud shotting him. I just look so wrong, but it feels so right. Yep. So, are there like people? There are Pokemon just randomly hiding out in bushes. Oh yeah. Pokemon like to hide in the tall grass. Much. That mud shot, though. That's the move. That is the move. Jeez. Banshee might be the one that gets us this. Alright. Gotta heal up. Put this in the oven for a minute. I need more mud shot. Maybe instead of a dehydrator, it's like a rehydrator. I don't... I don't know, man. I just it, like to believe it's an oven. It's a sous vide machine. It's a trash compactor. They throw out the one you had and give you a new one. It's just a big lie. Route one. Yeah, route one. That that thing that pops up in the top is what tell us what region we're in. So, oh, excuse me. That's what controls like. Once we catch something in route one, we can't catch anything else in route one. Mm. Oh, too far. Okay. What a fleek, and you seem to have done the thing. Oh, the package you got me. Okay. And you know, the ray just shows up and, like, what the heck did you call me for? And old man's like, oh, yeah, I called you in here to take this book, I guess. And go out and uh, Pokemon in this game. Oh, you got a Pokedex. Yep. And five Pokeballs. I can't catch already? Oh, man. I screwed up our last game, but don't worry. <laughs> it didn't really pan out for us anyway. <laughs> uh, man. Rachel. I'm gonna miss horse. I'm gonna miss horse. I. You didn't even get a seat. 
you can get any of the revenge. It's going to be an episode worth watching. Oh! oh. So we have five Pokeballs, so we should have to catch this guy. Zigzagoon. Zigzagoon. Uh, I don't know. There they are. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. Let's. We had that one move that puts him to sleep. Yeah, Grass Whistle. That should help. That increases numbers. Yeah, he's asleep. He's asleep, so we can't fight as hard when you throw the Pokeball at him. There we go. Do you have a nickname for Zigzagoon? Uh, um. Goonie. Yeah. Perfect. His name is Goonie. And he is dumb and I love him. Let's see. Normal Psychic. That's a decent combo. Got to look at his moveset. Rock Tomb, which is a Psychic move. And Poison Sting, which is a Psychic move. Why is Rock Tomb Psychic? RNG. It took a move from the mainline game and randomized its type. So Goonie okay, might end up being pretty dang good. After, you know, we level him higher than two. And he wakes up. He's gotta wake up. Oh, cast form. Oh, cast form. Cast form transformed into cast form. Cast form changes type based on the weather. But the weather is normal. So he changed into his normal form? Yeah. But they made sure to let us know. I guess I didn't... I accidentally didn't cheat in the game before because we killed the Route 1 Pokemon we were trying to catch. More Pokeballs. And then we'll head out to the left, try to catch something, and then we'll head north. So how much money do you have? 1,080 Poke whatevers. Uh, get some potions. And... Give everybody a quick heal up. And then we'll head to the grass. How do you get more money? You have to defeat other trainers. And then you steal their money when they're down. Is that really what you do? You don't steal it. They hand it over willingly. But that is how you make money. You have to win tra trainer battles. But there's not really any trainer battles until you get to the Viridian Forest. Which we could just walk to after a small tutorial. But I want to use this section to get something. Ah! Oh, a Lapras. Go to sleep. Close your mouth when you sleep, please. You look like a snorer.
Snorpress. Snorp Snorpress. Oh, come on, Snorpress. Don't be like that. Hit it. But I might have to hit it. No, oh, Snorpress tried to heal itself. Ah! Oh, you killed it. Too strong for my own good, man. Ah, oh, that didn't feel good. Alright, this guy's gonna said. teach us how to tell how to catch Pokemon. You can't get past this part. And I don't have any control over the menu speed of this. It moves at this old man's pace. What's his name? Um, Dumas. Is he a Dumas? He's a bit of a Dumas. He uses his last Pokeball on a Weedle. And he gives us a Teachy TV. Oh, good. Okay. The game has so many baked in tutorials. It is ridiculous. But only to somebody who played the original that's just like, get out there, good luck. This is Route 2, so we can catch something here. Chop. Machop. Machop. Go to sleep, Machop. Um, Hyperbeam? Okay. Ow. Yeah, I was afraid that, that Hyperbeam was going to be heckin' heckin' kill. You got a name for my chop? Pork. Pork? Yeah. Pork. Pork. Now now say it. Say his name with his type after. Pork pork chop. Okay, I see what you're saying now. Mm-hmm. What type is he? Asleep. That makes sense. He is a fire type. Yeah. He's got good special attack. Hyper Beam is a fire move, and Sludge Bomb is a fire move. Sludge Bomb looks like a good move for us. Uh, let's hop into the forest and try to catch one more thing, and then get to the point where we have to try to level things because this is the team we have to take on whoever Rachel is now. Alright, what do we got? Yanma! Go to sleep, stupid bug thing. Uh-oh. 
Yep. I, it kicked its way out of a ball while asleep. I feel that. We caught it this time. Uh, you know what name's for her? It's a her? It's a her. Yoko. Yoko the Yanma? Yoko the Yanma. got Yoko. Ghost Dark. That's a decent combo. Uh, special attack type. That's not good for a Ghost Dark. Well, no. Dark is special. Ghost is regular. Okay. And it has two Dark. Confuse Ray and... Okay. Well, that's the team. Yeah. We have to hopefully survive to Rachel. Or whatever her name is now. Yeah. yeah. Go to the... Go to the heal. Yeah. Free health care. We don't want anyone dead yet. Or at all. Really, at all would be good. Let's see, let's put Dooney out front. Oops. Nope. I know this game really well. Trust me, I can't get out of a menu. So let's level up Goonie. Yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna try to keep them all even, and Goonie is level two. Okay. So I'm gonna go into the forest and then pop out. Like Goonie's gonna come out naturally, and I'm gonna switch to. Uh, what did I name? <laughs> did you name him? <laughs> Banshee? I just blanked on Banshee's name. So you go through the bushes. I got a magnet. But yeah. How does it work? Item boost electric types. Okay, I don't have any electric types. Sigh, duck. I am so glad I didn't get one of those. Oh no! Oh. Goonie! And we have our first death instantly. Oh lordy. Alright. He is super effective against. Oh, cool. That, that's one of my favorite moves, is they complement them, and it boosts their attack, but they get really confused about it. Uh, let's see if we need to put them to sleep. Nope. Okay. No. Cool. Alright. Keep boosting. Is it my special attack? Yeah. Grass is special. Well, time for a funeral. Yep.
going to bury my first friend. Do, 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 do. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Someone's PC. And Goonie. Rest in peace, Goonie. Lend them into candy. Uh, that, that doesn't happen yet. Well, who's the next person we should level slash sacrifice? Pork or Yoko? Uh, pork. Good luck, Pork. Forest, man. Yeah. Yeah. See all the trees? Yeah, see all the meridian? I can't see the forest for the trees. Oh. I see where you're going now. Let's fight this person. Analyst Kimberly. It doesn't make sense to have a net to catch Pokemon when you're supposed to catch them at all. You know, that's not where my first thought was, but sure. No! no work! This is a terrible run for us. It's been quick attacks both times. Sorry, did I say snark? I was still being upset about the loss of pork. Sixty-nine experience points, though. Nice. Yeah, I wanted to share that sixty-nine with pork. This right, Banshee's gonna be the only one left. I, I need to level. Who's left? Yoko. Yeah, I need to level Yoko. The cat outside my door just screaming. I think Kohaku went to bed and the cat just wants me to go. Which at this rate, you know, I'm gonna die. <laughs> We're down to two, and we Maybe haven't even Yoko's made it through winner. Viridian Forest. That's the wrong PC. The move Pokemon, that's what it is. Goodbye, Pork. We barely got to know you. Okay.
Let's see if we can fight out here and not get quick attacked. Oh, it's a love disc. Oh, it's a love disc. Yeah. Yeah. Yoko didn't die. That's really what's important here. I think Love Disc might be our saving grace. All you need is love. How about a Diglet? Ain't nobody got time for a Diglet. Um, the Diglet doesn't even have time for Diglet. It tried to get away. What? Oh, I stole. I don't think I'd ever seen that animation before. It legitimately surprised me. Uh, I gotta take it off the Pokemon. Gimme. Give Gimme give the big pearl. Oh, it's just a sell for money item. What? Oh. Type <laughs> flourish. <or? laughs> just... This guy comes up to your crib looking for a fight, man. He has that look. And he dead. Okay. Let's see if we can get quick attack to death in here now. I believe in you. I... I... I mean, I've only killed two Pokémon so far, and we've only fought one trainer. And I have apparently lost the ability to use a D-pad. Look who it is! Draco Funky? Draco Funky. How, how did Draco Funky get in here? Well, he's an analyst. He can do anything he wants. Uh. And he's got a Kakuna. And, taking a sc and it's dead. Yep. Oh, you learned Snore. Finally. Huh. Did not see that coming. I am sorry, Draco Funky, for the murder of your insects. It's okay. You say that, but he's going to message me after this episode goes up. Yeah, the randomizer program... Oh, excuse me. Since you can randomize names, it has a section where you can add names if you want. And I added some choice names, and I didn't expect Draco Funky to be the one that showed up first. Nobody expects Draco Funky. That's really his whole MO, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Phoebus. Hmm. Don't like that. That's not good. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Prematurely huh. scared. Get Yoko out of here because he's gonna have other two other Phoebuses, isn't he? Phoebe, Phoebe, Phoebe. What's the plural of Phoebus? 
Never mind, it's a whooper. Uh, the plural of Phoebus is whooper. Well, my two living Pokemon are doing pretty good. Uh-oh. Oh. Yep, just gotta do that a few more times. Uh... Alright, fighting. Webster. Webster. Phoebus. Assuming, I didn't look at Snore, but I'm assuming it works the same way as it did before, where you have to be asleep for it to be any good. Uh. That burp was well timed. Phoebus is confused. Phoebus is confused. Thief. Steal it! Steal something! Yeah, Yoko, now you're level 9. Uh... Oh. Tired of this non effective attack, so I hope this isn't the thing that kills Banji. Well, uh. if I'm not getting out of those not very effective attacks. Yoko, come back. I made a mistake. <laughs> Deal it, Yoko. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Phoebus. Ah. So why are you stealing from it? Uh, if it's holding an item, we can't stand a chance to take it. Oh. Which most trainers won't have their... Most early trainers won't have them holding an item, so... We're not stealing anything. Don't want to lose Banshee out here. Fight that person. Pony. Oh, Ponyta. Only have one thief left. Hey, hey, it was super effective too. And we stole something. Oh, and we stole TM something. TM twenty four. What? What's TM twenty four? Uh. A move? Let me take a look. TM pocket. Where we don't have access to our TMs yet? Cool. That's weird. Okay, we'll figure that out later. need to move. Oh. I have to take the TM from him first. Okay. Her. Sorry. It was an all-girl team. Now can I look at the TM? Yeah. 
future sight. Two turns after this move is used, the foe will be atta is attacked psychically. Yoko can learn it. Okay. The delay the inevitable attack. But Yoko has no thief left, so... Okay. Oh no. Sand slash. Slan slant slash. Mud shot. Six to nine experience. Nice. Hail. A grass type move, hail. Mm, no. No, we do not want hail. That would end horribly for me. Wellington? Wellington? Whooper? Wellington has a whooper. Well, let's see what Wellington's whooper can do. Die, apparently. That's the best thing for it. Put it out of its misery. You're good at this. <laughs> Thanks, Wellington. This is still Route 2, so we can't catch anything here. Okay. Put everybody in the oven. Everybody in the oven. See that Jigglypuff sprite on the left there? Yeah. Is that just creepy to you? That Jigglypuff has seen some shit. Poo, poo, poo. Now I have audio of you saying that. <laughs> I don't know if we can take on Rachel like this. But let's take on the jerk that's there first. All of my instinct is telling me to save right now, but that's not worth a thing in the Nuzlocke run. We don't even know if his name is Brock. Uh, Gymnast Shaggy B? Gymnast Shaggy B. <laughs> oh... Pulls out an Ekans. Ekans! Mm. Okay, not very effective. Oh, Ekans is digging. Oh. Good. All right, Shaggy, what else you got for us? Mudkip. That seems on brand. No, he likes mudkips. Mine whip. Oh. oh. Hit yourself in the face. Put you out of misery. Oh. No. It's fine. I'm faster.
If I'd have missed there, I'd probably eat my words. Alright. That went pretty well. Let's leave. Let's see if we can get past Rachel this time. <laughs> Shouldn't you put him in the oven first? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. And the last time we got hit so hard that I went out and power leveled for a long time and still turned around and lost. This time I'm just going full whatever. It's almost 1.30 a.m. Go, go full normal. He says he's Brock now, but what will he be when the battle starts? I love that synthesized snare. Dr. Ornag. Lazy Dr. Ornag. Yep. Larvitar. Beef. Beef. That, that worked well. That, yeah. I like it. Might get Dr. Orgnag defeated yet. Or. Spider. Okay. Thief. Thief. Thief or Confuse? Thief. Thief. Okay. Yeah, you were on the money there. Because all he's going to do is do growth, and I'm still faster, so I can just turn around and thief him. Oh, Dr. Orgnag didn't put a lot of much of a fight there. Yeah, there we are. Yoko's level 12. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. It's not very good for us. We can't put ourselves to sleep. Yeah, Dr. Orgnag. From Brock? No. No. Dr. Orgnag. And he's gonna talk a bunch more. Lunch? Alright. Draco Funk? Yeah? I think after I put these guys in the oven, we should call it an episode. Alright. Because you sound like you're ready to fall asleep. I feel like I'm ready to fall asleep. Yeah, it'd suck if we fainted. Yeah, it would be game over. IRL. Yeah. So... Being the one gym victors we are. Good night, everybody. Good night. <laughs>